All right, tensions are rising after parents and students learned that several HISD principals may no longer be with the district. That's right, multiple protests happening outside of Houston schools. Students and staff showing support for their administration. Fox 26's Jade Flurry is live outside of the Meyerland Middle School. So, Jade, what were parents saying? Well, we did stop by two of those schools where the protests were happening earlier today. Both parents and students expressing their frustrations about their principals being given the option to either resign or not have their contracts renewed for the upcoming school year. Everyone hears the words Mike Miles and it just sends everyone into like a flying rage. Students, staff and parents are rallying outside of HISD campuses. <laughs> demanding answers about recent staff cuts. A lot of parents are really upset right now is that we don't have a say in what's happening in our district. Outside of Myerland Middle School, people protested after their principal was given the option to resign or be fired. I feel like it's unfair that like Mike Miles just fired our principal and he was just principal of the year last year. Bring Dr. Back. Over at West Briar Middle School, parents came together to discuss the recent leadership change at their kids' school. The principal, Dr. Leah Michelin, given the same choice to resign or face termination. We're very, very upset um, because Dr. Michelin has been a wonderful leader for this school, and she's this is the end of her third year here, and she's done phenomenal things. When asked about the cuts, HISD issued a statement saying, in part, in most cases, if a school has an A or B rating, that's a strong indication that the principal is creating the kind of learning environment students need. When a school is ranked C or lower, it often means the school is not serving students well on a consistent basis. The statement did not comment on a specific principal. A member of the Houston Teacher Federation who chose not to be on camera out of fear of losing her job says more job cuts are coming. And today we just got the news that 11 of our students, I mean 11 more um, personnel are going to be removed. And if these changes continue, would you guys ever consider pulling your kids out of school and maybe going to a more stable school district? Yes. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> 100%. <laughs> Now in that statement, HISD went on to say that division leaders will work with impacted campuses to identify priorities for the next school leader and the process will involve surveys, community uh, meetings and opportunities over the summer to meet with incoming applicants. Reporting from Southwest Houston, Jade Flurry, Fox 26 News.